Owners of several capital city bars are facing money laundering charges in connection with a large-scale drug trafficking operation. New tonight, we're learning more about the charges four people are facing as part of an investigation dubbed Operation Stop the Flow. Eyewitness News reporter Steve Nielsen has those details live from our control room. Steve. The latest people arrested in this operation own two Providence bars, and police say they raided their homes, confiscating more than a quarter million dollars. The latest arrests in Operation Stop the Flow. Four siblings busted for money laundering in Providence. Donnie, Edel, Andre, and Johanna Sanchez. According to an affidavit we obtained, Providence police say the four used South Beach Restaurant on Atwell's and Flow Nightclub on Cranston Street to launder money obtained from illegal activities. One of the siblings, Johanna Sanchez, was arrested back in May, accused of being one of the ringleaders of a Providence Cranston based trafficking ring. Make no mistake about it. This is a significant, a major drug operation. Now she's charged again as part of the next step in the operation. Police say she's also evaded taxes, saying in the affidavit, it is evident that Ms. Sanchez only claims approximately $12,000 on her personal income tax return in order to receive the maximum amount of federal and state aid and financial support of her children. Authorities say they confiscated over $300,000 in cash and jewelry like this. Plus, the records show they found nearly $36,000 in cash in a pillow. Despite the investigation, both South Beach and Flow Nightclub remain open, but Providence police say they will appeal to the city for their closure. And everything has to run through a procedure. If it was up to me, I'd have them closed right now. Donnie, Johanna, and Andre are facing money laundering and tax filing charges. Edel was arrested for gun possession. I'm Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.